Hello, my favorite people. It's Kim from KTV Creates. Thank you so much again for joining me today. For those of you that are new here, you know the drill. Go ahead and click that subscribe button and tap that notification bell because I promise you, you will not be disappointed. I do tons of Dollar Tree DIYs and I'm just getting into doing a lot of thrift store, um, trash to treasure type videos. So I'm really excited. That is what we're gonna be doing today. You all said that you loved them and you're kinda of sick of seeing some of the Dollar Tree DIYs. So I'm switching it up a little bit and I've been obsessed with going to my local Goodwill stores um, and I found a lot of little uh, goodies that I can't wait to revamp. So that's what today's video is all about. So we're just gonna go ahead and get right into it. Okay, so first, because it is the holiday season, I'm gonna show you the two pieces that I got that are um, kind of holiday, Christmas related, winter related, I guess. Um, I guess you could make it more winter. It doesn't have to be uh, strictly Christmas, but I'm obsessed with sleighs. I don't know about you guys, but I found this cute little sleigh at the Goodwill. Um, it's kind of a heavy piece. This was $3.99. Certain Goodwill stores I found are not as good at pricing as others. So some of this stuff gets a little bit pricey, but I thought I didn't think that was bad for $3.99 for this cute little sleigh that I'm gonna obviously paint and decorate. And then <laughs> I loved this tree, although it looks really sad as is. It looks like it needs some love, but I've been like wanting to pick these up and I've seen them at Walmart and places like that, but they're like $10 a piece and I just couldn't bring myself to spend that much. This actually wasn't marked, there wasn't a price on it. So the girl I got at the register charged me like $2 for it. So I thought that was a good deal. So I'm excited about that. And just a couple little finds that I found, this little beware sign, it has um, the little, you know, uh, indentation in there to look like shiplap. So obviously I'm gonna paint it. I'm not, uh, you know, I'm not a big Halloween fan. This was 99 cents. And then I absolutely loved this. I thought it was so cute. Um, this was only 99 cents. It's just like a little house. It has like a bronze finish, which I definitely won't be keeping because that just doesn't go with my decor. But I didn't even realize it when I bought it. It's, it has this like nice leather um, wrapping around it. Uh, and this was 99 cents. So I thought that was cute. We could definitely do something with that. And this I was really excited about. It caught my eye and um, when I picked it up, I realized it's a little table clock, but I realized that um, it's a Pottery Barn clock and I got it for $3.99. So we all know how much Pottery Barn things cost. So I thought that was a good deal and a nice little decorative piece that um, I honestly don't have to do anything with because I love it the way it is. Then I found, I've been seeing these a lot lately and um, I just think they're the cutest little things, but they're like a really thin candlestick. I would think it's like a standard size candle that fits in there, but they're three different sizes. These are brass. I'm sure I won't keep them brass because I really don't have anything in my house in that color. And the set was $2.99, so I loved them. Oh, and then this is another winter type piece that I got. Well, they're all, they all like vary. But I got this whole bag of snowflake ornaments for $3.99. And they're like really pretty, just different like crystal type snowflake ornaments that I'm going to use in my kitchen to decorate. I did some trees above my cabinet, so I'm going to put them on there. And then I did pick up these. I wasn't sure about these, but I liked them. I mean, I can gift them or do something with them. Um, but these little, they're heavy. It's like a, a slate. Um, so it is really heavy and it has this, this little clip on it, you know, that you can put something on it, whether it was a menu. Um, I'm guessing someone used it as, um, I'm guessing like a wedding um, centerpiece or something like that, you know, like with the table number on it. Um, but these were both $1.99, so I picked up the both of them because um, I thought we could definitely do something cute with them. So I was excited about that. And then because you know, our next holiday coming up will be Valentine's Day. So I saw this and I thought it was cute. It was... 
$2.99, but it has a home goods sticker on it. And that says $9.99. It still has the tag on it and everything. I'm not a huge decorator for Valentine's Day. Uh, I don't really get into that that much, but I thought it's, it's a wood piece. It's really cute. We could do something really simple and easy with that. And then the last two pieces are, um, I just love to get like little pretty like bowls and things like that just to use around the house to decorate with, um, to put things in and, and just pretty things up. This beautiful bowl was $2.99 and it has, if you're familiar with like that milk glass type finish, um, that's what it looks like. It has the, you know, the grains in it. I don't think it is milk glass um, because it usually says on the bottom if it was, but I just loved that trim around there. I thought it was beautiful. So I'm excited about that. And this I thought was so awesome. It's $2.00. But isn't that the cutest little shape? And it has this pretty little detail on the sides around it. And I just loved that. I thought it was so cute. It's a neat little shape. I don't know what you would call it. Um, you guys are really good at helping me out with that stuff. So if you know like what this is generally used for, I'm obviously gonna use it you know, for decoration purposes and things like that, but I'm interested to know what you would call this or if it's just a candy dish, I don't know. But that's it, that's everything that I got in my latest thrift store haul. Thank you so much for joining me today. I know how much you guys love these. Stay tuned because I'm sure you'll see these recreated um, from Trash to Treasure and me like revamping them and doing something new and different. And until then, thanks for stopping by. Click that like button if you like this video and I will see you all soon.